I am Peyton Baeza and I am a senior on the University of Dallas volleyball team. I mainly chose UD because it was very similar to the school I went to growing up. And I like the idea of having smaller class sizes, knowing my professors, knowing the people that I'm actually in class with. And I like the fact that I could talk to my professors and they actually knew who I was. I wasn't just a number. For the volleyball program, I think the biggest draw for me was that the girls on it were so friendly and they were so welcoming and they didn't even know who I was yet. I was brand new and they were just very willing to open their arms and take me in. I think the biggest setback for me, even though it's been pretty smooth sailing in comparison to others, is that the course load and the workload here is very rigorous, very time consuming, and I don't think I ever could have been as prepared as I needed to be to come in here and actually take on that workload and do it well. Um, so I started in FCA the second semester of my freshman year and I became the vice president my junior year and then this past year starting as a senior I became the president of FCA and I think I joined it mainly because I was looking for a group of friends outside of my inner circle which was mainly my team at that point and I wanted to meet new people make new friends that were older than me on other teams people that weren't athletes and that was just a really big draw for me. So we didn't really have FCA when I was in high school. Um, we had something more like student council, which I was still very involved in, but I wanted to find something similar here, which is one big reason that I also joined FCA was to be involved with my community, with my school, and with those that I really didn't get to talk to on a daily basis. So this past winter, I actually went down to Mission, Texas and did mission work. And back in high school, I did the same kind of thing. I went as a student and a participant. And now that I'm older and in college, I go as a chaperone with my high school group still. And we basically go down to Mission, Texas and we get to run a kids camp for them. And when we do that, we are there from basically 6 a.m. to 10 p.m. And we have an opportunity to minister to these kids, have Bible studies, devotionals with them, but we also get to have a lot of fun with them and just serve them, be servant leaders in that sort of way. I definitely think that going down to Mission Texas and working with those kids has definitely impacted my life in a way that I didn't really see coming. And being a business major, I think that that is something that I could use going into my life and my future career. I could see myself working in maybe a nonprofit and being able to serve others, which is where I find a lot of joy, is helping those who really need it. And I really think that it has impacted me in a way that I won't ever be able to change. <laughs>